Acura updated its DLX sedan for 2018. The changes are minor, some new sheet metal up front, new bumper covers and a revamped media system. Acura hopes it'll excite customers enough to consider the brand, and to entice driving enthusiasts, Acura brings back the sporty A-Spectrum to the lineup. A-Spec is a nod to Acura's performance roots but without much in the way of performance gains. The trim is mostly superficial. While it's not as aggressive as an AMG massaged Mercedes-Benz, it does get you different bumpers and larger wheels with wider tires. The base TLX V6 comes standard with 18-inch alloys sporting a 225 series tire, which becomes 19-inch alloys wrapped with 245 series rubber and a spec trim. For the accurate faithful, all the brand's acronyms are present, Precision All-Wheel Steering, or PAWS, along with Super Handling All-Wheel Drive, SHAWD, the latter is only available on V6 models. You could potentially buy a TLX A spec PAWS SHAWD. Hopefully, the trunk lid will fit all those letters. Acura is also trying to sweeten the TLX's pot by making its driver assistance package, Acura Watch, standard equipment. That means you won't have to check in extra box and spend extra money to get forward collision warning, lane keeping assist, or adaptive cruise control, even if you want a base TLX. Like most in the class, Acura has variable drive modes to adjust shift points and engine performance. These modes include economy, comfort, sport and sport plus. Obviously, sport and sport plus delay the shifts and make the engine more apt to wind out for spirited driving. While that's all good, the real perk is in the steering. If you're in econ or comfort mode, the steering feels like a Honda, super lightweight. Switching to Sport Plus makes it much heavier. The added weight helps make inputs more precise but doesn't help with the numb feeling you get from electrically boosted steering. Suspending the TLX is a pair of McPherson struts in front and a multi-link setup in the back. It's not as sharp as a double wishbone system, but it does a good job keeping the rubber stuck to the road. The ride is comfortable, even with the more sporty A-spec tuning, but stays flat during cornering. You'll notice potholes, sure, but they won't rattle your teeth out. Combine that with the Apex wider tire and the SHAWD system, and the TLX suddenly becomes a formidable canyon carver. It's no M3 or AMG C63, but feels better than the rest of the Japanese competition. Braking, too, is solid, and the nose doesn't bite the ground during emergency stops. Those emergency stops should happen less often thanks to the standard Acura Watch Safety Suite and the two-screen media system with Apple CarPlay and Android Auto. Acura says the entire system is 30% faster and more streamlined than what you'll currently find at dealers, but in the real world, that's hard to notice. Aside from the some quirks like needing to be at a full stop to connect your phone and activate Apple CarPlay, the system works well.